Would you like to learn about machine learning model development in Python? If you do, practical machine learning in Python is for you. In this course, we will cover different aspects of data processing and machine learning model development and eventually proper visualization and reporting of your results. We will go through different algorithms in supervised and unsupervised learning, and we will touch on reinforcement learning, although it is out of the scope of this course. Initially, we will go through Python programming. We will see how different libraries and functions in Python can help us to develop a machine learning model. Going from preparation of our data for machine learning model development, eventually developing our machine learning model and preparation of our reports and proper visualization. We will cover different algorithms in classification setting as one type of supervised learning. And we will compare classification with regression as another type of supervised learning. And we will see their differences. In both those categories of supervised learning, we will cover different algorithms like random forest. And we will cover theoretical aspects, some assumption and interpretation, and eventually implementation of those algorithms in Python. Most importantly, we will learn that there is no single method that is the best for every single data set out there. Then we go through another important concept in machine learning model development, which is bias and variance trade-offs. We want to have a good machine learning model, not only in our training data set, but generalizable enough to work in our test data set. And one way to take care of that is working with regularization. We will learn about regularization and we see how we can use different techniques to come up with generalizable models. Then we will go through dimensionality reduction. Depending on the data set at hand, we can have tens of features to millions of features. So sometimes we need to decrease number of features or dimensionality of our data. We cover different models and methodologies like principal component analysis as an old traditional dimensionality reduction approach. And eventually we will go through some more modern and advanced techniques like UMAP and TSNE and we see how each one of them can help us in machine learning model development or visualization. Also, we go through unsupervised learning. We, we will learn about different clustering approaches like agglomerative hierarchical clustering and affinity propagation. And we will compare them with other techniques like k-means, and DBSCAN. And similar to supervised learning, we will learn that there is no best model for all data set. And eventually we will go through visualization techniques and how we can benefit from different types of visualization to increase impacts of our models. And at the end, we will go through some interview questions in machine learning. If you are a student or employee or employer in other areas and you want to get into machine learning, you may like to learn about some of these interview questions in machine learning setting. So this will be the concepts that we are going to cover in the six sessions of this course. You don't have to choose this course, but you could if you wanted to.